Hello everyone and welcome back to a brand new video from Braid1. Today I will be showing you the brand new AMD Vega cards. But they are against cryptocurrency miners and I'm gonna explain why. So now that AMD has noticed that the cryptocurrency world is buying every single card that's available, even the AMD Vegas are being sold out pretty nasty to miners that are using it for cryptocurrencies like Zcash. And they came up with a brilliant idea to get rid of us. So they came up with the brilliant idea to sell us only one card per customer and they want you to buy a lot of stuff with it what you don't really need as a miner. So the miners need to buy CPUs and a motherboard and they get free games and they have a discount on a really expensive screen. And then you get the card with it. So you can only buy a single card and you have to get a lot of stuff that you don't need. But let's imagine if you buy 100 of these cards with all those components, you can just cover your whole wall with motherboards and uh, make a really nice table with CPUs that we don't use. Well, I'm not really sure why they did this, but probably their heart is still by the gamers and not into the cryptocurrency world. But let's talk numbers first. We all know that the AMD Vega wasn't so good at Ethereum mining for example, because this card was drawing 300 watts to accomplish a really low 35 mega ashes per second at very max. So we are gonna have three new cards, the gaming editions of the AMD Vegas, the 56 version, the 64 version and the liquid cooled 64 version. But these cards will probably be very bad at Ethereum mining too, maybe a little bit better, but because of the HBM2 memory, that's not gonna be a huge difference. So I would recommend mining Zcash with these cards if you think it's worth it. And that's all the information I got for you today. So hopefully you all enjoyed this video and see you guys in the next one.